My daughter died in a rowboat and I never told anyone. <laughs> Until now. I killed someone with my car. Fina, can you look at the monitor? Do I have enough blush on? You know what I like about it? From the side, it's nuts. I saw a picture of myself from the side recently. It's also like, nuts from head on. <laughs> well, can I share something candid with you? I wish you would. This dress under this poncho is so tight that I think if I went like this, macho man Randy Savage style, I could rip it off. I think that would be very fun and exciting. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> Quick. Ugh. Stop it to a Slim Jim. Hi, I have a hot toe, Trixie Mattel. <laughs> I don't know what I said. Hi, I'm the self-inflicted stigmata to get you attention on Sunday, Trixie Mattel. <laughs> and I'm a hot lizard granny woman ready to spread my acid brain. Katya. And welcome to oh. the show where we talk about whatever we want. Because it's our show. And not yours. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, does it seem hot in here? Uh, I don't know. It's almost like the globe is heating. Do you think so? I thought it was my fibromyalgia or my that Crohn's is, disease. That is the 2018 pickup line. Hey, yeah. is it global warming or are you just happy to? Nope. <laughs> is it global? Is it hot in here? Or is it just global warming? Maybe I'm just getting older, but I also think that the, the proof of global warming is, to me, summers now are much hotter than I was a child. Harder? Hotter. Hotter. <laughs> Hotter. <laughs> Hotter. <laughs> it's, it's, it's hard because you as one person giving up hairspray, it doesn't feel impactful. And it's not, let me tell you. So don't worry about it. Have you ever thought about focusing on your carbon paw print? Hmm? You dog. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know how to respond to that. <laughs> not only is the world warmer, I also found out I'm a dog. So. <laughs> well, as a woman, to me, I mean, I'm, you know, I'm like carbon footprint. Uh, <laughs> you know, can I get a pedicure before I put my footprint down? God. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. No. Well, what I know from school, from science class, about global warming is, you know, things like um, chlorofluorocarbon, CFCs. Oh, wow. Thank you, small class sizes. Mm -hmm. um, basically have created a hole that is only rusting open further. So the atmosphere is gaping, 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 <laughs> gaping, gaping, gaping. I'm just trying to keep it gay. Yeah, no, you're keeping it gay. Gaping. You know what's also discouraging? They say like, within X amount of years, we will run out of fuels and everyone will die. So then as somebody who's not gonna have grandkids, I'm sort of like, so you're telling me for the next 30 years of my life, I'm in the clear? Yeah. Fierce. And if you're not like the heir to an Amazon fortune and you're born like 50 years in the future during like the Mad Max Fury Road kind of situation, yeah. Good luck to you. And we're worried about having enough resources to support the human race. Does every human need to procreate? Are you noble? Can you fly? What are you passing on, bald uh, Stephanie who works at a bowling alley? What is so great about you that needs to be more. Continued. Yeah, uh, LeBron James, for example. Yeah. He's tall, athletic, handsome, and is very into philanthropy. Yeah. Let's get more. Sure. If you're just like a sort of got okay good grades in school and you have like a bum knee, so we don't I'm, need a copy of you. No, actually, we can throw you away. Yeah. You can even die. Yeah. yeah. Euthanasia is not a four letter word. <laughs> it, there's, it's a sensible option to just. You know, yeah. exiting quietly with dignity. Do you, know what do I mean? you like, believe that water world is coming? Ugh. Do you have gills behind your ears? I hope not. That movie sucked. That's like, In that movie, they eat dirt. Yeah, it's Tuesday for me, bitch. I will never forget the part where he pees into that machine, turns that thing and it comes out as water and he drinks it. That's hot. Do you know that you can drink your pee? Yeah. If you had to? Yeah. Or? One, two. Have you been peed on? As you drink What color is this Red Bull baby? Have you been peed on? Mm-hmm. Are Not you... in the mouth. No. Not in the mouth. No. I would like to maybe try getting peed on my ass. Oh yeah. Something nice, yeah. But maybe not, probably not today. Okay. Not like here right now. If that's where this is going. I like I have you, a but hot not... bag of pee in my <laughs> People still have children. Today? 
Yeah, it's like, the, have you ever seen a population uh, growth graph? Everybody wants to have children, yeah. everybody wants to have multiple. It's going like this. You know, you can just and nothing happens. Yeah, you don't have to just in the mouth. <laughs> in the mouth, that's your campaign. Or in the butthole. Yeah, yeah. Do we other things to the, the vagina. Also, yeah. From an economic point of view, it makes sense to be like, well, this is not an immediate problem. You sacrifice a future for the riches of today. It's like if you are um, a Capri Sun salesman, you're like, hi, fructose corn syrup isn't real. You know? What? The people who make their money from oil are like, don't be crazy, buy more oil. Yeah, fracking yeah. is, what is fracking? I think it's a Real Housewives of Atlanta thing. <laughs> Isn't it? Fracking? Isn't it? Okay, it's high pressure. High, it's to extract it? oil or gas. Yeah. Honey, I've got a lot of oil and a lot of gas. Come to my house. Also, um, there's a lot of ways where you can reduce uh, your global warming participation, which is... Uh, Clothing production and carbon footprint. I think there's no need for any more new clothes. We don't need new clothes. No. If you shop vintage and used, you're not only fashionable, you're doing good things for the world. Yeah. This is thrifted. Yeah. This is lifted. I stole it. <laughs> yeah. Stealing is yeah. the ultimate upcycling. Oh yeah, no new stuff. Hey, listen, if you don't have the money, you just gotta get, gotta get creative. One man's treasure is another man's treasure. Yeah. <laughs> Your treasure uh, right. is my pleasure. And I'm stealing <laughs> yeah. it. <That's>... Yeah. <laughs> These earrings, okay. Even here. <laughs> okay. That's all, yeah. that's all. I didn't take them, but that's all. <laughs> just the earrings, thank you. You know, the other thing is people who get coffee every day and they use disposable cups every day. Every day, sometimes three I'm not times. A, no way. Absolutely. I'm not a coffee drinker, so. I'm not gonna bring my jug from the barn to the, you know what I mean? <laughs> Your trough? Your coffee <laughs> yeah. trough? Cough trough? Hey there, fill, fill Your her up. Trophy. Yeah, yeah. Frappuccino, extra large. Yeah, oh my God. You fill up my stone mug. <laughs> I want you to go in with a not even rinsed out milk jug. It's like, can yeah. you put yeah. spicy? Yeah. The curds hot. provide seasoning. Can you put piping hot coffee in this <laughs> cardboard milk carton? Also, can I use your email? <laughs> People who don't believe in global warming have ulterior motives. Yeah. And they have willful ignorance. Yes. Well, you know, uh, a complex, multifaceted worldview is a lot more challenging than a simplistic one. That's true. That's mm. really true. There's two sides to every story, and there's actually like 15 sides to my roast beef pastrami <laughs> curtain. <laughs> I. Personally, I feel like with public opinion, the current political structure, at least in the United States, we're... we're... Yeah, honestly, yeah. I think it'll come right up to the basically judgment day of like, we're, it's water world now. Oh, yeah. And people will be like, oh, I changed my mind. I yeah. care now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the earth, is, mother nature's like, she's doing the hustle. And she's like, I don't, I told you. Now you don't, no. no. Yeah. One last thing. Science changes all the time. That's actually true. What if in two years, scientists were like, oh my God, never mind. Yeah. You were gonna laugh so hard. It's perfectly feasible for us to say five years from now, knees, not what we thought they were. Well, it's like people when they were like, cell phones will give you brain cancer. Yeah. Fool me once, shame on you. Melting ice caps, draw my babies, oops. <laughs> <laughs> I think that sums it up for really <laughs> Quite nicely. It's not funny. Uh, please care. Hear I'm gonna up. upcycle my ripped up dress. Okay, but, but hear, me, hear me out. So no, right now. <laughs> telephone poles. Okay. Bungee cords. No. <laughs> with a saddle. <laughs> okay. You press a button. You position yourself first. You press the button. It says like really far, medium, and like just down. You know. Oh my God. And you just get catapulted. And what? You I mean, gotta be spry. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be spry. You gotta also know where you're landing. Mama, that's What's the thrill. outfit for this? That's, a, oh, a romper. <laughs> <laughs> so no helmet. Some Uggs. <laughs> I, and, it's, and also natural selection. Yeah. If you don't survive the fall, you were never meant to go to that meeting. Yeah, I think this is when global warming's really kicking in. Crispy critters are getting hungry on the ground. You gotta. <laughs> Oh, so it's not even safe to land travel. No.
All stars. Yeah. You did it, I did it. You know what no one ever talks about? What? How much harder All Stars is than normal Drag Race. Yes. Have you ever wanted to go on Drag Race, but then surprise, no one's struggling because everyone's rich, famous, and confident? Yeah. You have to be strategic, poised. You have to be slim, but um, a little bit fat. You gotta have real frizzy, chunky, natted up hair in the back. And definitely hey, were diabetes. You robbed? I was burgled. God, you was robbed. Yeah, the you true winner of All Stars. That's the true tea, robbed, mom. Yeah, you ready for some piping hot, scalding tea splashed all over your freaking face, bitch? No, me neither. <laughs>